Oke, okay, Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. So today I will be sharing an inspirational story of the author of Atomic Habits, one of the best uh, books that change the habits of people to become productive from uh, procrastinating. So basically this guy is once a very poor person. He was uh, born in Ohio, uh, in Cleveland, I think, yeah, Cleveland, Ohio. Uh, he was once from a poor family. Uh, his name is James Clear, and he's now one of the most successful writer in the world, and has successfully became a public speaker, a blog writer, and also a life-changing uh, book creator or book author. And he actually has uh, one of the best books uh, in the world right now, which is Atomic Habits that I have mentioned before. And yeah, so his journey started when he was uh, actually a kid. He writes to write a blog uh, out of something that uh, maybe when he was bored, he used to write blogs and it became popular and it helps other people in certain topics. Uh, and also, uh, when he started uh, his school, he is actually a very, very intelligent person. He writes to, he likes to write. Um, maybe his academics is not really that good in other stuffs, but he knows how to critical things and have the ability to easily uh, learn new stuff. Uh, also, uh, when he was in high school, he was actually, he actually almost died because he has a. Uh, uh, overcome and a life-changing injury that could actually kill him. Uh, so basically in high school he was one of the best baseball players in the America and almost got into an all-American team and when he uh, got uh, injured he uh, he stays or he was injured for like two or three years until he was fully recovered from his small habits and that I will mention later. So when he was playing baseball, one of his friends uh, was swinging the bat to the baseball and the bat got flung to his nose, like here, between the eyes and the nose and also the brain. And it made him, it uh, made him unconscious. It gave him uh, concussion and brain injuries. Uh, he almost uh, lost his memories, but Thankfully, he was rushed into the hospital with a helicopter, actually, because uh, when he was rushed to the nearby hospital, he was uh, very critical and the hospital cannot handle him. And that is why this uh, guy got a fl flight with a helicopter to go to a better hospital. In there, he spent one year to actually recover and get uh, and uh, change his uh, mindset. He, he needed to change his mindset to actually fully recover. So after the recovery, he was actually sent home because the doctor already uh, let him uh, go home. When he go home, he still uh, needs to learn how to uh, move again, still needs to learn how to control his emotions again because his brain was apparently in, uh, injured very badly. Uh, and then he has the mindset and he didn't give up like that. He uh, made a new method to actually uh, change himself 1% uh, better daily. And he implemented it in the book Atomic Habits. So uh, first of all, he uh, tried to sleep early. He tried to learn. Uh, uh, basically, he tried to become better 1% day by day. So he, he realized that doing bad things, even 0.1% a day. And if you do it accumulatively, it could uh, make you a bad person, it could uh, ruin your life. And he actually uh, learned how to manage that. He made uh, a new method to uh, become more productive. And yeah, so basically he, he went from zero and then he recovered, he uh, trained um, only, first of all, he only trained three kilograms uh, of muscles per day. And after that, he actually uh, changed into two kilograms until 10 kilograms. And he get to the physique he wanted again. 
and he went back to baseball for the first time again from a very low team in the uh, Cleveland, in Cleveland, and after that he went uh, and played with his full passion. He trained every day, one percent better, and after that he actually got into the McDonald's uh, All American team. So what we can get here is you should. Uh, learn how to make better your, of yourself, make a better version of yourself, 1% by day. It could change your life. Uh, it's better than uh, becoming bad 0.1% uh, a day, accumulatively. So maybe that's all that I can uh, say, and uh, I hope this story can uh, inspire all of you guys here. There, last time, done, okay. And thank you, wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.